April, why the fuck are you snowing? Like, it's been snowing for the past two days. Cause, like, Tuesday, uh, we, we kind of had, like, this slushy snow, and my friend actually spitted out and got a flat tire, so that was fucking stupid. And right now, there's probably at least three inches of just regular snow on the ground. Why? It's April. Almost all the snow was melted already. Fucking A. God damn it, but, yeah, April, stop. But anyways, hey guys, as well, we got a match here today against June Bugs on Showdown, because I've just not Wi-Fi battled recently, so yeah. Uh, it's a UU match, using my UU team, because that's what I like using. So, I have a text, but um, uh, yeah. Opponent's team, he's got a pretty standard team, actually. Just the only unstandard thing, quote-unquote, is like the Amoongus and the uh, Shan... Or not the Chandler, the uh, Frost Last, but those are still pretty good, and they're still pretty useful. It's just kind of weird seeing it, how uh, he's got both Chandler and Frost Last, just synergy-wise, but, I mean, he's got to cover pretty well, so he's got really nice synergy going along, but he's really defensive, so it's going to take a bit of, you know, power to take him down, but, uh, threats, <laughs> it's just mainly, I guess, threat-wise, quote-unquote, his Amoongus, the... Uh, Shane Allure and the Azumarill just cause that core is just gonna annoy the fuck out of me but I should be able to play around it well enough so we'll just see what happens but I decide lead wise I'm like Shane Allure maybe he'll lead with Frost Last which I can at least hit down to its Sash and then do something later or Brawn Song I mean that's a perfect lead matchup and if it's something else I should have a decent enough pivot so I can just go from there but uh yeah I'm just gonna leave with Shane Allure and he's actually gonna lead off with the Frost Last and uh I'm just gonna go straight for Shadow Ball. I figured he'd either go for Spikes or the Taunt, so I figured it would be safe enough to go for the Shadow Ball. Uh, he does Taunt me, but I'm like, okay, now let's go to Raikou, because he's probably just gonna set up a layer of Spikes, but he's just gonna Destiny Bomb spam Destiny bond spam a bit. But I'm like, okay, let's go to Swampert, try and get Rocks if I can. Can't, because he Taunts, which I kind of expected, but I'm just trying to switch around until I can finally not have him Destiny Bond. But I did waste two Destiny Bonds on my, uh, whatchamacallit. On my Raikou anyways, so it's like, he's getting me wary with doing it, so that's, so I kill him. But uh, now he's going to go into Azumarill, I'm just going to have Flygon in, because I was like, hey, I don't take Spikes damage. But, going to Swampert, because I knew he was going to go for Ice Beam, I was like, U-turn, and he went for Ice Punch. Oh, it's not Ice Beam, Ice Punch, whatever. So, going to Swampert, get rocks up, Amoongus comes in, I'm just like, fuck it, I know he's going to go for the uh, Spore, so I just called him, I get the burn, which is pretty nice, so that's going to make that thing a lot easier to deal with. Not that much, but it's just the right amount of... Stuff I need to just kind of, you know, start hitting it down. But, uh, yeah. I brought in Rose Raid on it, because best thing to bring in at the moment. I'm just going to start going for Spikes, because why the fuck not? He goes into his Bronzong, though, to get up his uh, Stealth Rocks. Not really too bothered by it, because whatever. But now, since I got all my Spikes up, I don't have HP Fire on this Rose Raid. I got to go to my Swampert, who can uh, take Gyro Balls, essentially why I brought it in. So I'm just going to go for the Stealth Rock, or not Stealth Rock, just try and go for Scald. Right here, he does create me with Earthquake, which does lower my survivability, but it brings me into Torrent Range, which will help with killing him off of Scald. But I'm just going to keep going for Scald, because I have really nothing better to go for. And he's going to go to Amoongus, because he's like, okay, I can take Scalds, right? And it actually does, like, more than I thought it would. I mean, even in Torrent, it's just like, that is a pretty nice amount. But just going to go for Scald right there, and it does still do a little bit, but he... I figured I would just fodder this thing off anyways, because I don't really need it that much. So, that's that. But I'm going to go into Mianchan now, and just in case you want to go into Shade and Lure, I'm just going to Stone Edge to take, try and take that thing out. But, uh, I take it out with Stone Edge, so that works. But he goes into the, uh, Azumarill now, and I'm like, okay, I have no idea what he's going to go for. I don't need to Rose Raid too much, so let's just go into that see what's going on. In case he wants Aqua Jet or some shit, but he just Ice Punches predicting Rose Raid. It's not like I needed it anyways, so I'm not really too bothered, but... Getting on Raikou, because I know I can scare him out and hit something with a strong Volt Switch. And now, since he brings in Bronzong, I figured Shane Allure can scare him out. I thought he would go to Snorlax or his own Shane Allure, so I'm like, alright, let's go for Sub. But he just stays in, so I'm like, alright, well, I doubt he's going to switch now. He's probably going to just want to sack Bronzong. I missed Fire Blast, and it's like, come on! Son of a fuck. But, I'm going to go into Raikou now, and just go for the Thunderbolt. And it, unfortunately, does not take him out. Again, it's just like, god damn it, this Bronzong needs to die. But fortunately for me, he does go for Toxic, which means I can 
live to fight another day and just kill him off with a Thunderbolt. And he decides to go to Snorlax because I thought he, I guess he thought he could take a Thunderbolt decently, but it does a lot. Like, damn. But that return does tell me he's most likely banned, plus I see no lefty, so I'm like, alright, let's go to Flygon. And uh, Earthquake should be able to kill off everything on his team. And Earthquake kills off Snorlax because, uh, you know, it's Snorlax. But I did run a calc that crit did not matter on Snorlax, but it just goes into the Azumarill. Does not crit the Aqua Jet, which means I can take him out. And then I always get out to Shin Lure, which I outspeed and take him out with Earthquake. So that is the match. So GG, Junebugs. It was fun. But, uh, yeah. that that I, I, I'm pretty sure that Bronzong, though, was kind of a misplay. I think if he didn't do that, it might have been his game, but I'm not sure. Because he probably meant Earthquake, but he accidentally talked to... I don't know. I, I, I don't read minds, but it works for me. But, uh... Yeah, that's it for this, so I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll probably be streaming tomorrow so I can finally try and get some Wi-Fi battles, but it's just whatever. But, uh, yeah, fuck the snow. But that's it for this, so hope you guys enjoyed. Such, such, blah. Rick, comment, sub, and later, guys.